Well, well, well. Hey guys, what's up, what's happening? I hope you all are well. Peace be upon you all. Today we are back with another episode of Car Mechanics Simulator 2018. And yeah, let's get to our, uh, let's get some jobs done today. I hope it's going to be a long episode. Oh, only 52 seconds to accept. Okay, take, 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 take order. Okay, I want to get as many orders as we can. It says poor brake. Oh my god. Racer type. Okay, it says poor brakes. The car has poor brakes, but I guess I can see why. Um, I mean, if, if your car is looking like that, I mean, I'm sure you're fast, you're speeding and you're stomping on the brakes. Anyways, let's get this up. Oh, wow, the tires on this are thick. Uh, if you remember in the last episode, we worked on a VW Golf as well. Uh, its tires, it was running on 205. I think there's 195 from all I can see, but yeah. Overview mode. Oh my god, ABS module, that's bad. So maybe that needs to be replaced. We will actually replace that. And of course, all the four brakes. Heard? Okay. Haha. -ha. I see. Um, okay, let's see what it says. ABS module, brake caliper, brake disc, brake disc, ventilated brake pads. Okay, for, so first of all, we need to take off uh, tires. Access, of, access from engine bay, brother. I am sitting in the engine bay. Yes. Take this off. How do you let it get to this point, bro? Like, surely you need to open your engine bay once in a while to see that, bro. <laughs> now something's wrong. Okay, um, anyways, now then. Just set these off. These are all uh, good. We're not going to be changing any tires or uh, rims or anything like that. Anyways, oh my god. Wow. Okay. Wow. What has happened to this car? I'm, I guess it's been sitting for a really long time. Oh my god. Oh my god, brother. Oh my god. Stop for Lalazim. How do you let your car get this bad? I don't understand. Oh yeah, by the way, new haircut. Yeah. I don't really like getting my haircut. I like I want to have long hair, but it is what it is. Uh get the caliper off. And I saw in the over uh, in the job task list we also need to replace a caliper. I'm not sure which one that is. Because the culprits that we've just come across, those all look fine. Those all look decent. You know, they actually look really nice. I'm surprised they're not rusted, even though the rest of the uh, brake is rusted. Oh yeah, you can see this. Either th there's no tread on the disc, or the disc is actually. F oh yeah, the disc is actually decent, and we found our caliper that needs to be replaced. Get that off. Brake pads. I think all of them need to. Oh, this is 94%. Okay, we'll see. Uh, I'll just buy parts according to the task list on this car and then we'll see if we need anything later. And also this side looks good. I think the car was sitting in some water on one side. Uh, but I just wanted to take everything off just to make sure. Bro, this is brand new. 83%. 94%. Great. Okay, so now if we take a look at the cars. Okay, ABS module, brake caliper, brake disc, brake disc ventilated, brake pads. It says pads, I'm not sure which pads it wants. I'll buy four pads though. Uh, brake, I am a slow typer. Oh wow, I can't even type. Brake, enter, okay. So we need one brake disc, $70. One ventilated one. We need a brake pad, I'm going to just buy four. And we also need the ABS, ABS. Uh, ABS module, seven hundred dollars. Whoa, that's uh, that's that's expensive. Okay, let's just get this uh, installed. Oh no, I took it off. Port mount. Yes, this is brand new, bro. Okay, and uh, ABS module mount that one hundred percent. Mashallah, it's better to be one hundred percent. I just bought it. What does it say? Tomal Corporation. Hmm. Sus indeed. Okay, anyways, uh, now back on to this area, part mount, brake disc ventilated 100%. Okay, and add the brake pads. You know what? Okay, so only one needs to be replaced, I see. I was about, I was gonna be like, well, let's just replace all of them. There we go. And oh yeah, while so here we might as well just put the tire on and get this whole thing sorted. Oh yeah, so this is two five fifty five or fifteen. I I'm not sure why this looks uh, why the tire 
side will look bigger than the car that we worked in on last episode. But anyways, it is what it is. Uh, that's all done. Okay, install brake disc, the new one, yes. And uh, the brake pads, 94%. Uh, and caliper, done, 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 good. Screwed, screwed in, and then the rim. Yes, please. Yeah, yes, sir. Getting all work done. Like a true mechanic. Meow mechanic, <laughs> And if you've made this, if you uh, if you're still watching and you made it to uh, this point in the video, uh, make sure to comment down below. I actually cannot speak though. Anyways, uh, if you've made it till this point in the video, make sure to go down and comment meow mechanic villa. Yeah. Uh, and whilst I was saying that, I put on a too, too good of a brake pad. Okay, let's go back over here. Yep. And the caliper and the cylinder. Yep, yes sir. And good. Standard tire B. Yes. Yes. Good, that side is all done, and let's just part mount, brake disc ventilated, and brake pads, 100%, yup, brake caliper, oh, okay, so the brake caliper cylinder is fine, we just need a new caliper, okay, um, brake, Oh my god. See if you type too slow, breaky, breaky. If you type too slow like me, then it doesn't, uh, you know, it, it, it stops too quick. Anyways, uh, part mount caliper, brand new caliper with uh, the uh, other uh, with the cylinder from the other caliper from before because that was fine. Anyways, and our tires. And yeah, Alhamdulillah, car is all good. Let's see the status. All good, Subhanallah. And 14, around 1500 pounds. That's amazing, Mashallah. Let's get another job. That only took us literally seven minutes. Take order. And take order. Okay, well, let's just move this car and then we'll take that order. Never worked on this before, to be honest. Um, move car to lifter A and we're going to get this car and move this to, you know, the parking. Yeah, look at that. Nice. Mashallah, nice. This car has a lot of rust on it though. Um, okay, let's see what's the issue with this car. Overview mode. I see some red on the brakes at the back. Uh, oh, no, no, no. Okay, let's see car status. The brake disc, brake caliper, brake caliper. I guess that's, uh, you know, the the back uh, stuff because at the front it looks fine. Let's just go over here, overview mode. The front looks fine, to be honest. Yeah, the back. Yeah, the back needs to be worked on. Okay. Um, so, yeah, let's get, uh, let's get to it. Wow, I really like this rim. So, can I please unmount? Can I? Oh, wow. <laughs> I really try to unmount a tire without the car being up in the air. Okay, in that time, oh my god, okay, yeah, your bumper need paint. Um, let's see what's, yeah, again, a brake job. Bro, we're just doing brake jobs, come on, man. Katagiri Katsumoto. What car is this actually, though? Can I guess? Hmm, it looks like some, I don't know, you give me VW Passat vibes, to be honest. But the Passat never came in a coupe. Maybe the Chiroc. It doesn't give Chiroc the vibes though. Or maybe a beam from the back. It looks like a beam. Maybe that like E46 type of headlight. The uh, facelift E46. It had those LED lights. I actually love those headlights. Bro. Uh, they look so good. Get all this off. Okay, and the wow, my god. My god, brother. To be honest, since we're doing a lot of brake uh, services, brake jobs, what we'll do is we'll just buy a ton of brake stuff right now. I'm just going to go ahead and take the other side off. 
and we're going to go and spend a ton of money uh, to find this brick pad. Pad we actually already have, we bought four, and we literally use only one, I believe. And let's just go get cal calipers. We'll get four calipers. I mean, these are expensive as well. If it's $70 a caliper, then I'll probably get f five calipers. Or maybe eight, I'm not sure. But anyways, uh, since of course in the other car we also need to use the, these parts. Okay, break, break, uh, disc. Five, 350 break pads, one, why not? Three break uh, calipers, yep. Three of those, actually we'll buy more of these. Five, and yeah. That's it. Okay then, so let's get on. Okay. Get in there, mount these new brake discs, uh, brake pads, with the old ones. I wonder if, you know, if I put brand new brake pads, hold on a second, hold on a second, whoa. Condition is dead on these, okay. I wonder if I, you know, like how I let's say the brake pad is 94% and if I put 100% ones on them, like 100% health, if I get a bonus or not, maybe, maybe not, maybe it's too small of a difference for anybody to notice, including game. Um, yeah, once we get this car done, that would be an easy job. Let's see, let's, I wonder how much we're going to get paid for this. Brake pads, a new caliper and then the wheel and then we're literally done we're going to just get rid of this car and i also heard the teeth of the back so which means we have another job and it's been 12 minutes of me recording i wonder how much of this is going to be edited out because i like edit out the stuff where you guys get bored anyways uh, let's take a look all done 500 dollars okay anyways 500 dollars for a few minutes of work i probably i think we spent five minutes on that car uh, caliper, caliper pads, let's go overview mode, where is the stuff, front, front side, so just the sides, okay, let's move this car, car lifter A, and let this, uh, let's get this car in the air, and get working on it, I believe it's only this side, Bro, the state of this is insane. See, this is what the good thing is. When you have parts on hand, you don't need to go away to the computer and come back. I'm just, hey, literally, I'm working right. Switch to part mount. Get the new, oh no. I see. Spoke too soon. I do not have these parts. Great. Time to buy some brake discs. Uh, this is not the right one. I think I did buy these, but anyways. I'm spending a ton of money. You never actually, if you're operating in real life like this, bro, you must have some serious cash flow problems. Um, because over here in, in the game, we're guaranteed to get customers. In real life, it's all, you know, you never know. Hold on a second. Yeah, the car was all right. So anyways, um, and now fit the tire, fit, bro, can I please back up? Can I, yeah, thank you. Uh, anyways. So if you're a Malkak in real life, please do not be doing what I'm doing. Please do not buy parts and bulk. Unless, of course, you can afford If you have the cash flow, if you have working capital, then sure, go ahead. Why not? It makes your life easier, like how I'm about to explain. See, without exiting the part overview, we're going to replace the caliper, the brake pads, and the discs. Watch this. Actually, the brake pads have... 59% health. In this, I'll actually go ahead and I'll actually add a brand new brake caliper, uh, brake pads, brake pads, brand new. See if the person notices or if we get a bonus. Yes. Okay, and the rim. And see, without exiting the overview mode and the part selection, we're all good. And there we go. I think this job is done. Car status brick pads. Okay, so there's also another place where we need to, you know, get brick pads. 
maybe this side I, I think it is this side right hold on a second overview mode yup it is so let's uh whoa, whoa, whoa. okay brake caliper oh my god bro you need more than just brake pads you know what will nice you and will get you a new brake disc too you know i'm going extra for the job but hey to get the repeat customers you need to do stuff like this you need to go up and beyond um, the requirements and that's how you get a loyal customer who will come back to you and also to be honest you don't really want to charge for the service unless because they didn't ask for it so you're just doing it out of your the kindness of your heart but in the beginning you do need to do stuff like this to you know keep your customers going okay that's all good bro 231 dollars oh my god yeah the parts that we put in the game put in that car were worth more than that i think whilst i'm here i just want to pick up some of these 150 dollars literally what basically what we just made uh gone like that let's pick up another job why not um oh my god this is a huge job i read it in the newspaper that the timing components should be replaced yeah that's too big 14 seconds to play all gear, gear falls oh my god sloppy car steering car is hard to control we'll, we'll take this and then we'll end this video uh this is the car it looks like some volvo to be honest car started oh my god oh my god okay wow 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 that's a lot that's a lot of stuff okay uh, overview mode wow that's insane well 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 let's get to it rather than complaining let's actually get to it okay then first of all what we need to do is we need to get rid of the, oh yeah we need to yeah, I, know, I know i know i know lift the car up What on earth is happening on the right mirror over there? The LEDs on that. Okay then, we basically need to just replace all this. This is a huge job. I thought the timing component job was big, but nah mate, this is much bigger. Um, but we do need to replace all this right. I mean, I, I mean, it's all just bad, right? It's literally all just gone. I mean, how, how, where have you been keeping your car? Wow, bro. How do I, uh, there must be something in the middle right here. Wheel hub bearing, front wheel hub. Okay. I do really want to do this stuff in real life, bro. Out of tie rod. Okay, and the sway bar. Okay, so we'll need to get another bar for that. Anyways, uh, get this off here. And now this is basically just levitating. Okay, in a tie rod, and that needs to go. And I guess that's it, bro. All this is gone. Wow. Okay, we'll jack it up. I wonder how much of this stuff we need to actually buy. Um, actually, first of all, let's go on a shopping spree um we need okay so first of all what i'm going to do is i'm going to take a picture of this okay and i'm going to go ahead and buy the parts oh my god brother i spent literally like six minutes well, that wasn't that much just buying parts so now we have all the parts we need 
um, all of this okay I've bought it uh, I hope if I haven't missed anything so yeah bro now let's just get to disassembling this car um, uh, bro I need I need this off okay well let's just go overview mode okay well let's see okay what's wrong over here okay well first of all let's just get this off I was not expecting to you know take such a big job because I wanted to finish this video but I guess not this is I think big, the biggest job of our career yet if we uh, bro you better be paying me in five digits after this I'm probably sure that that's not going to happen but anyways let's just see okay well wow I cannot are you serious okay anyways uh, oh my god I can't even access overview, overview mode uh, let's just take do I do not think we need to take this off I just want to get this off right yeah and uh, the sway bar front sway bar coming off okay overview mode okay well that's an issue what is this wow okay well I guess I guess we can take that off from here right oh my god are you serious oh my god the whole thing disappeared okay well that's good um that's really in the transmission in it oh my god it just came off wow that's good and now let's see uh, if we just go out overview mode okay so there's no more red left in here apart from that bushing okay uh so let's get over here come out rubber bushing wherever you are okay so now let's just part mount rubber bushing brand new rubber bushing in there front drive shaft yes sir we got that uh front drive axle c yes sir get that in there and uh, outer tire rod no we need to get the sway bar front sway bar in there good and I mean it didn't say in the job that we need to replace this and plus it looks in good condition I'm literally inside the air filter right now <laughs> anyways um, what else okay front sting knuckle get a brand new one in there lower suspension arm yes 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 good okay in there sting knuckle yep front shock absorber get that all in there okay and what else what else oh yeah over here in a tie rod this thing is going to need an alignment out of tie rod what else is missing i guess that's all good okay yep 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 alhamdulillah mashallah we are progressing and we have new jobs coming left right and center and i'm not going to spare a dime on this bro we're just going to we're going to spend some real money on this in hopes of making some real money as well so yeah but anyways i think uh yep put the wheel hub bearing in there and the drive axle in there good and can we put the wheel on now hey eh? nope not yet sway bar end link okay and now we can put the wheel on car status mashallah we've picked up out of a lot of stuff mashallah good so i guess we can put the wheel in yep so now what we're going to do is we're going to just hop over to the other side that's all done now we're going to just uh, you know get all this stuff on brand new break this for our brother here old brake parts i guess i've used all the new brake parts is that so i'm not sure though i hope not because i bought a ton and the cost is a ton uh we're currently not doing very well in the bank side uh 1602 dollars we have three skill points we should actually go ahead and uh, see i i guess that yellow thing is skill points right toolbox unlock upgrade okay yeah new 
Okay. That's good. Uh, so now we have... Oh, okay. So that wasn't the three. I'm not sure what the three is. If you know, please do comment down below. Okay. Well, now then, we should start off with the back. Um, awful lot. Not an awful lot here. Let's just get this stuff off. That comes off and... There we go. So basically we do need to re replace everything. We do need to remove everything as far as I'm concerned. And then we'll be able to you know, get the condition of these parts in if we need to replace anything else. And okay, so before any further ado, I oh yeah, this I know that needs to do, do needs, does need to be replaced. Um, is it this spring or is it that spring? I'm not sure. Oh my god, it seems to be that spring. Look at the state of that, bro. Look at the state of on this side. Okay. Let's see the state of this rubber bushing 11% front shock absorber. Wow, we're doing this all with the wheel on. Yeah, that's something new. Uh, I do love this game, bro. Don't get me wrong. Oh yeah, I, I guess it's this first thing that needs to be replaced. Okay, well, now let's just go overview mode. Okay, so we have this and we have... Wow. Okay, well, let's uh, let's start getting this off. I wonder what time it is. Um... Okay, it's 2.44. Okay. I see. I need to be home by 3. That's not good. Let's just hope that this, you know, gets done quickly. Your suspension arm. Get rid of this first. Look at the state of the rust on this, bro. Crazy. I wish in real life this stuff was this easy. Imagine. Okay, whoa, whoa, whoa. Move, move, move. Come on. Oh, look at the state of this. Oh, it's so rusty. How is this stuff still intact? Honestly. That thing disappears. Oh my god. Do not. Yep, we're going to need to. Yeah. Yeah, yep, we're going to need to come here. Okay, well, good thing is that we did not remove all this stuff for nothing. So we just need to, you know, just remove uh, that. Okay. And... I remove that just in case. Okay. Now this comes off. Bro. Okay, good. So now let's go overview mode. There's nothing... Uh, of red over here so I guess we can now start mounting the parts I have all the parts here all the parts and now it's just to screw everything in yep rubber bushing small rubber bushing get that in there get this in here oh yeah and rear sway bar, get that in there, spring cap, yep, spring, yep, and this rear shock absorber cap, yep. What a weird angle we are in right now. I just want to zoom out like this, yeah, that's good. One, two, three, good, yes, uh, nice. One, two, and we have our sway bar and link over here. Screw that in, and there's the suspension. No, there's the, yep. Yes, please, and get this in there. What else is left, bro? Yeah, on the front. Yep, put that in there. And wow, and we're all good.
Mashallah, it, I was expecting this to take much longer to be honest. But Alhamdulillah, it has not. Just checking everything over. It looks all good. We're just going to go to overview mode, that's all green. Now to work on that. Um, for status, a lot of stuff is, you know, it's been put in. Okay, well, these rubber bushings. Okay, well, we'll take a look at that. I'm not sure where those rubber bushings are, but we'll just hope that they're in the stuff, in the stuff. Okay. And... Okay then, all good. Brake pads, and before we get the tire, I'm gonna put the caliper on, but before we get the tire on, I'm just going to go ahead and check if we have gotten everything done. Bismillahir Rahmanir Rahim. oh no. There's still three markers on that. Where are those rubber bushings, brother? Overview mode, nothing. Okay, so I found one. Okay, there's one over there. Okay, so there's one over here, right? Where is the other one? Let's get the car down so that I can use overview mode like this. One over there, right? So that, but that's only one. Okay, so there's one over here, right there. Where are the rest? Please don't be at the front. Seems to not be at the front. Hmm. I am very confused. Well, let's go ahead and get this thing back up. Again, where was it? Just want to make sure it was on that side, right? Yep, it's all the way up in there. Okay, and it's this front one, right? We're going to take both of them out. There's that, there's that one. Oh, so I highlighted. Oh, okay, mashallah, nice. So you know how I started it? Yeah, so it shows over here. Okay, that's good. And okay, mashallah, that's good. I was about to be like, oh no, where did. Where is this stuff? Mashallah, good, 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 good. Okay, so now car status amazing. And now, so we just need to put on. Uh, the car parts, um, part mount, part mount, part mount, brother. Hold on a second. Why can't I mount the tire? Okay, so we still have stuff to put in, mashallah. There we go. Nice, and now on the other side. Um, part mount, get the stuff in. Wow, the reflection is insane. Okay, and that's it, bro. Subhanallah, we have done it. Let's see. Wow, okay, car status, everything is done, total payout 3000, it is what it, what? Oh, sorry, my god, oh my god, yes, I do realize, yep, I know exactly where that, yep, spring top, rear spring, good thing I don't need to take all this apart again, if I did, that would be, <laughs> that would take a long time, subhanAllah, good. We are back up to the $4,500 uh, $4, mark. And yeah, with that being said, guys, this is a much longer video than I had intended. But yeah, it is what it is. Thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. If you made it till here, comment down below. Me, I'm Mechanic Villa. And with that being said, I'll catch you in the next one. Peace be upon you.